It's Tuesday the 11th of February. This has just reminded me it's my sister's birthday. Um, we'll start off with a business statement uh, from Michael Wood, uh, who is the Deputy Leader of the House. He'll be standing in for Chris Hipkins today. He'll outline uh, what's going to happen uh, next week uh, in the House, opportunity for uh, some questioning from the opposition on that. We'll then go on to questions for oral answer. Um, Shane Retty to the Prime Minister, although traditionally on a um, Thursday the Prime Minister is not in the House, so likely to be the Deputy Prime Minister. Uh, does she stand by all her government statements and actions related to COVID-19 response? Uh, Tangi Utakere to the Minister of Energy and Resources about the Lower Mission Vehicles Contestable Fund. Uh, Dr Nick Smith to the Minister of Local Government uh, about consultation uh, on the Maori Wards and Maori Constituencies Amendment Bill. Uh, Dr Tracy McClellan to the Minister of Health uh, about the progress of Hei Ara Oranga, the report of the government inquiry into mental health and addiction. Uh, Willow Jean Prime to the Minister for Economic Development. Uh, what recent reports about Northland? Uh, Julianne Genta to the Minister of Finance uh, about the cost of housing. Uh, Angela Roberts to the Associate Minister of Education um, about supporting clearer and more relevant learning in schools. Uh, Nicola Willis to the Minister of Housing about uh, the uh, making of space available for housing uh, and the timing of that. Uh, Shannon Halbert to the Minister of Transport about emissions reduction. Matt Ducey to the Minister of Health uh, about uh, frontline mental health staff and services. And Dr Liz Craig to the Associate Minister of uh, Science, Research and Technology about uh, research uh, into COVID-19. Uh, we'll then go on to legislation. I think there are four speakers left on the uh, bill which updates the film, videos and publications classification uh, which flows out of the uh, Christchurch terrorist uh, incident. Uh, the sexual violence uh, legislation bill, second reading in the name of uh, Chris Foy, uh, which um, is a, an attempt to reduce the re-traumatisation of victor, victims of sexual violence when they go to court. Uh, and then if we get through that by five o'clock, uh, which is when the Parliament now lifts on a Thursday, we'll start the secondary legislation bill in the name of uh, David Parker. That's the second reading of that. We'll be back here again uh, two o'clock uh, next Tuesday.